Good. What is this? Thursday. Thursday evening. Sorry, guys, with uh, Gavin just getting out of the hospital yesterday and back home. And thank you all for your wonderful well wishes. He is doing fabulous. And we are so thrilled. Um, just so thrilled. He's back on, well, he's back to himself, 100%. No more bag, no nothing. And yeah, he just has uh, this week to re recuperate and then he will be back to work, uh, which he already has been, but um, not since this operation, since the first one. So... Um, now, after this operation, which was last Thursday, and he was released yesterday, and he is doing fabulous. So, yeah, things are good. So, tonight, we are going to do one of my handle boards, but I have some very special handles that I found that aren't really handles at all, but they're going to be for this. And I'm just, I had spray painted this board black. This is just a piece of Naughty Pine. This is not from my wood guy or my wood gal. Uh, this is just a nice piece of Naughty Pine that I am working on. So I put a thin layer of clear down first and I see there's a few little sparkles in here uh, from what I have no idea but anyway okay so we put a clear layer down first and now we're going to lay the colors so let's bring you on down so you can see that I spray painted this board black and away we go. So the colors we're using tonight are my Jet Black. We are using Langridge by Artie Sue's Rich Gold. We are also using her Turquoise. And we are using Color Passion Indigo. These are the colors we are working with tonight. So I'm going to put down a bit of black. And I'm going to put down, I'm going to just kind of play with this, bring, mix it in with the clear. So that is... Uh, black layer but a bit thinner than my usual black layers and now I'm going to put down um, I'm going to put down the Artie Sue turquoise but I'm not really sure what I'd like to do I think I think I just like to do some swipes of it. Along the board. And now I'm going to take the Indigo by Color Passion. And I'm going to put it in. That came out too much in the line. And now, oh, I think I will blow it before I put the gold and see what we get with this. So I'm just going to heat it up a little bit before I blow it.
Mm, no. I'm going to blow the colors in. And then back again. I think I need to make up a little bit more of the turquoise because I like I like the indigo with the turquoise but then down here there's not enough turquoise so let's make up a little bit more of the turquoise we are using Artie Sue's turquoise which is a very 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 pretty color and have a little bit of resin left over, thank goodness. Okay. Give it a good mix because it's a the turquoise is a powder, and it's always best to mix the powders well. It's also a good idea when you're working with powders to wear your mask. And I know I'm saying it and not doing it, but you all know that already, that you would just never hear me if... I was wearing my mask. On now. Okay. Now, what I think I might do is add a little more of the indigo right there. Yeah. Good enough? Okay, here we go again. Blow in. Okay, I'm liking that. So now I'm going to add my gold, but I am just going to drizzle this on where I would like it to go. Oh, I'm liking the, there's, we've got some cells happening here. That's got to be the, the jet black bringing them out because I'm not using any of the other 
colors. Okay, so with this, with my gold, I'm just going to, with the royal gold, I'm just going to heat it with the torch because that's when it does that, that spitting, the language, um, royal gold does like this spitting of these really cool blob, and it just looks like it's blobbing the gold. It looks really cool. That is cool. And actually, you know what? I think I might. Do that. Just little blobs. So you know what? You don't know. Like, I had no plans. No plans. I wasn't sure. Sometimes you know that. I'll come in here with a plan. I know what I want. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. You hope for the best. But tonight I had no plan. I knew the colors I wanted to use. I knew the um, handles I wanted to use. And it's going to also have little legs on it. But I had no idea of the design and I started with the lines and then blew it out and was planning on just blowing it to the left and then to the right. But then as I blew it this way, there were more effects. There's more little cells popping up that came out blowing it to the top. And then I added the gold and got little drips here and there and I thought that looked cool. So I added the drips and I could probably get away with a couple more. You know, and and I like that. It may not be your cup of tea. By any means, it may not be. But I kind of like the way it turned out. Kind of, kind of funky. And I love those colors together. The indigo blue with that um, turquoise. And this royal gold. On black looks friggin awesome I like that okay so now the part I've been waiting for and the reason I went with the royal gold and not a bright gold is they are knobs doorknobs but they are going to be handles for this board. Okay, let's see from here. Yep. Mm -hmm. I like this. I really, really like this. Hmm. And it's going to have these little legs will be on. They're the same tones of the gold. And they will sit like this in all four corners. Little legs. This is very, very nice. 
I have a few little things to, I thought I saw. Sometimes that's the only problem with the language. And that's what, so, oh, you know what? That's what I think I'll do. Maybe tomorrow afternoon, seeing how my hubby's doing. Um, I bought, I bought a bunch of these cups. And I am going to make, I'll show you, they come with, oh, They come with attached lids. I'm going to make up a bunch of the Langridge into a paste because I've told you how um, the Langridge is a more dense powder than Artie Sue's powders, my powders, Color Passions powders. It's more dense, which makes it really, you've got to really, really blend it when you're mixing it really, really well, or a good trick is to turn it into a paste. With a lidded cup, they will last you a few months, if not longer. I go through mine so fast, I really don't know, but but usually a, day, a good month or more with, as long as you've got a lid. So I bought a bunch of these, and maybe that's what we'll do tomorrow um is make up a few and i'll just remind you how easy it is to make your own powders into paste so if you have a powder that you find is a little if you have any of the language or i'm not sure what other companies powders may be more dense you could turn it into a paste on your own okay so i'm going to bring you down and show you this because actually guys i do i really really like this so come on down um you probably will get some glare and i'm sorry about that but if you want to see what the butterflies look like upright then i have to do it this way but that is my piece and you can see the cells that are coming through the black the jet black is causing some little cells nothing major nothing big which is okay because that's not what i was going for but uh I like it and you can see see what i mean by when you heat this gold it spits and so i added some bigger spits but see see where it spits when you heat it with the heat gun it will spit out let's see if i can do it while you're here See that? Did you see it spit? It spits the color out. See? That one's already been done, but there you go. See? Can you see it spitting the color out? It's kind of cool. Oh, dogs are out the back and barking. Okay, guys, so there you go. So that is um, tonight's kind of cool handled board and it was fun to do it was fun i like i like experimenting and taking chances and you know what if it doesn't work out it doesn't work out you can always and you know that um resin over top of it and you also know that i show you the good the bad and the awful you're all you're here with me so if it doesn't turn out when you're here Oh, well, you know, I can always go over it and usually do. 
And the ones that I haven't gotten to yet going over it are sitting at the bottom of my dust, dust shelf because I haven't gotten to all of them yet. But I've got some beautiful pieces of wood from my Live Edge gal. I'm picking up one hopefully tomorrow that is just, it's a secret. This one's a secret. It is the most amazing piece of wood. Just amazing. Uh, it's not going to be a board. It's not going to be a table. It's a secret and it's beautiful. And I also found these amazing, amazing basket tray tables. They've got the tray top that I can resin in and the the base of the table is actually a basket. You can, if it's in your living room, you can sit your throw um, blankets or some magazines or whatever in them. Um, I'm picking them up tomorrow. I got a really good deal on a couple of them. So that's what I am doing. And I am planning on being very busy Things are going really well in the gallery. Very, very well. I'm so blessed and so grateful to those who have bought and enjoy my work. I am so grateful to you. And I'm grateful to my followers and uh, my subscribers, the people in my group. And if you guys want to do um, I won't do one of those sales. I just, I don't feel right about doing a uh, fire sale or whatever. I just, I don't feel right doing that. Um, and I also, <laughs> I don't know. I, I'd be embarrassed anyway, but I'm, I'm getting my subscribers numbers are getting higher slowly but surely so subscribe and press the bell guys um if you'd like leave me a message and i will do a draw for one of my pieces um yeah i'll do a draw for one of my pieces if you would like that so so hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll know when i'm on Join our group on Facebook, our art group. It's Resin Artists Without Borders, but it's not just for resin artists, guys. Honestly, we have some amazing artists in there and photographers. And so come on, join us. Um, get over there to uh, Resin Pigment Canada and see the products uh, we've got in we've got Artie sue we've got color passion we've got northern lights so come on guys get over there we have a, a deal going on right now if you spend 150 dollars you get the whole five piece ocean pour set of Artie sue's pace and they once they're gone guys they're never coming back they're not being made again so these are the most gorgeous colors um so check it out online resinpigmentcanada.com and and go see okay so i am off for the evening you guys have a wonderful weekend it's coming up soon bye for now